Welcome, Pisces. Uh, Scorpions, happy birthday to you, Scorpions. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful, positive alignment of energies. All righty. So what is happening? What is transpiring? Let's go in. Happy birthday. It looks like a very, very wonderful year. Whatever is happening and transpiring, it's going to be an absolutely wonderful year. So Scorpions, it is... Um, so wonderful, so positive. A positive alignment of energies is coming up for you guys. And this is going to be good. So in the center, it's about secrets is coming out. Um, a whole lot of secrets was kept from some of you scorpions and you're going to be finding out. This is the birthday readings from the 9th until the 15th. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Now, when we look at... Uh, um, these first layers is as if love is going to be offered to some of you. Um, some of you Scorpion men between the ages of 18 and 45 is going to be having some sort of issues with your with your family. So I see um, you men um, 45 years and older is going to be having a whole lot of issues with you and your family problems, situation. Some of you men want a new start. That is men 45 years and older wants a new start with your family. So we're going to be first looking at the people from 9, 10, and 11. What is coming up and what is going to be transpiring in a collective um, collective uh, a group? What is going to be transpiring? So um, first we're going to be looking at individual what is happening and transpiring. So what we're seeing is that some sort of a family issue. I see some of you are going to be overcoming some sort of a family issue that has to do with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. It could be you men 50 years and older. Some sort of a situation where some of you men at work together with a fire sign woman, they are finding out the collaboration and that this person could be a family member as some of you are dealing with as a sister you're trying to work out some sort of an issue some sort of a problem i see a new start is going to be coming out and i see um some of you men are going to be needing um some of you men could be ending up in a hospital or going to be needing some sort of a health issue there is issue with um you men 45 years old and your family some of you are dealing with a fire sign woman. This could be your wife or this could be a sister or a mother. And there you're trying to work with this person. This person could end up in the hospital. That sort of a thing is coming up. Or it could be a lawsuit that this is your a lawyer. So we're first going to be... Um, and, uh, um, then, um, we're going to first look at the people who were born nine until 11. So for the people who were born under nine, you're dealing with family issues, um, relationship problems, marriage issue, um, definitely. And especially if you are married or in a relationship with an uh, Aries or Sagittarius, I see that this is going to be affecting your life in a very, very, um, heavy way. So be aware of this. Whatever the issue, the situation is and was that was transpiring. I see a whole lot of family issues, secrets about family issues is coming up. Secrets about Libra and secrets about an Aquarian and secrets about an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person. This could be a family member. A whole lot of information is going to be coming out about this person and you have to deal with a whole lot of family issue. You have the energy of six, ten, um, that is going to be coming up. Six is materialistic stability, but it's also love. You're dealing with Venus and this is very good because, um, it is as if some of you will be marrying or, um, connecting with your twin flame and soul flame. So that is good. As we move on and we look at the people who were born on the 10th of November, you are going to be victoriously successfully overcoming some sort of an issue that your child was in. Or young people, if you were in some sort of an issue dealing with work or um, some sort of a financial issue, you're going to be overcoming that. I see you're victoriously moving along and seeing um, and making transition in your life. Um, if you were um, expecting um, you were trying to get pregnant, this is going to be happening. Some of you are going to be leaving your relationship and Choose not to work on your relationship and just moving away from this situation and moving forward. So this is going to be good. So whatever the issue, the situation that was and that was transpiring, I see truths is definitely going to be coming out. Now, um, some of you are going to be um, changing cars. Um, I see you could be changing cars 
Um, I see you could be working on paying off for your cars. That sort of a situation is going to be coming up in this year and it's going to be good. So enjoy. You have seven and you have eight. And I see when it comes to business and work, it, you're going to be moving in the right direction. So take that and go with it. Uh, then we're looking at the people who were born on the 11th. You have the energy of the fool. The energy of the fool has to do with... Uh, um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person, or it could be human 50 years and older, you want a new start. You're hoping and you're looking and you're trying to figure out how you can create a new start in a new business for yourself. There has been a whole lot of issues that was created by a fire sign woman. And um, this has affected your life and your business. And I see you men, um, 45 years and older is trying to figure out some sort of a you're going to be dealing with a lot of low legal issue and you want to end to come to this. And I see some sort of a resolution is going to be coming in. So um, that is going to be transpiring. A whole lot of you are dealing with a Pisces man, whoever this Pisces man is and whatever is transpiring. I see you're dealing with some sort of an issue with a Pisces man. So be aware of that. So you guys have zero and four, whatever is happening and transpiring. I see new starts. I see a whole lot of new starts is coming up for you guys. And it is going to be a, a new start in a positive direction. Then we're moving forward and we're looking at the energy of the eye princess, the energy of the eye princess for the people who were born on um, uh, the 12th. You are dealing with um, um, finding out uh, information. Um, um, you're finding out a lot of secrets about a Libra. You're finding out a lot of secrets about a Aquarian. You're having a huge problem, a huge conflicts with a Libra. And I see secrets is going to be coming out about a Libra. So if you Scorpions was in a relationship with a Libra, I see a whole lot of information is coming out about this, uh, um, over this Libra. And I see you're trying to work and balance out some sort of a situation that is transpiring. So it's going to be affecting, um, uh, both this side and that side that secrets is going to be coming out about family. Secrets is going to be coming out about someone you were seeing. Secrets are going to be coming out about you men 45 years and older. I see a whole lot of conflicts that is transpiring and that is going on. So be aware. Then um, when we look at the people who were born on the 13th, we see success is going to be coming up. So if you're born on the 13th, I see a whole lot of success and I see money. You ladies are going to be coming in a lot of money. So that is good. So if you were born on the 13th um, of uh, um, November, you're going to be receiving a whole lot of money. Money is going to be offered to you ladies. Ladies 45 years and older, I see a whole lot of money coming in. So if you're younger than 45 years and older, you could be finding out ways and means of making money. But for women 45 years and older, I see a lot of money is going to be coming in. So the end, the energy of the sun is always really a happy year. Um, and this is uh, going to be a really happy year for a whole lot of uh, you that is born on the 13th. 13 is a good number. 13 holds the energy of the angels. And I see the energy of the sun is going to be coming in and helping out. Then we see the energy for the people who were born on the 14. It is a year where you're, you're, you are um, confronted by yourself, whatever is happening and transpiring. A lot of people who were born on the 14th of November is being confronted by themselves. A whole lot of information is going to be coming out. I see some of you are going to be receiving some sort of an offer. Are you going to be taking it? Yes or no. I see truths is coming out about some of you who had some sort of a connection dealing with some sort of a emotional issues. And I see people are going to be finding out exactly what was transpiring and information is going to be coming out. And I see whatever the information that coming out, a whole lot of you are going to be aware of what was happening and transpiring. So be aware of this. So I see the energy of the hangman for the people who are born on the 14th. And it is when you're going within and uh, um, it's like a year of revelation that is going to be coming up. However, it's going to be affecting you. It is a year of a revelation. Then we see um, for the people who were born on the 15th, a tower moment is coming down. Some sort of an information, some sort of a blockages <clears throat> that was created against you guys. Um, a tower moment is going to be coming down. 
and whatever that has been happening and transpiring um however the tower moment affects you guys it's going to be that you're clearing up some sort of a situation that was happening and transpiring and i think it is time for you to clear up whatever the issues is because a whole lot of you are going to be having some sort of issues that has to do with family issues and i see you're clearing up and you're making things um clear to people around you and you're taking um back your power and this is going to be good so um as um scorpions happy birthday again it is going to be a really 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 fabulous year it's going to be a year where you are making changes in your life and especially the people who are born on the 15th of november it's going to be a fantastic year because you end the year on the note where your wishes and dreams come true because something happened um, some sort of a block that was placed against you is now lifted so for the people who were born on the ninth, I see some sort of a sadness sadness with family I see sadness for an Aries the or a Sagittarius person or whoever this person is and whatever they have done to you it can come up as a mother figure or aunt or some family member I see sadness for this person whatever this person have done I see they found out that this person has not been um very honest with some sort of a situation you could be finding this out and you're going to be realizing what this person has done then we're looking at the people who was born um, on the tent. I see positive alignment of energy. Some of you are going to be buying a new house or a new car. Some of you could be relocating. This is good. I think that that's what some of you have always wanted. Then the people who were born on the 11th, I see you're dealing with some sort of an issue with Corporation, institution, legal issues, and I see that some of you men, um, I see it's as if taxes, uh, tax people or government institution organization could be coming down on you for some sort of a tax uh, invader that you have done. So men 45 years and older businessmen that is. So then we see the people who were born on uh, um, the 12th. I see that you are going to be having some sort of an issue, um, at your partner with your, um, your partner, your husband, your twin flame, someone you're in a relationship with, or a father or a brother. You're going to be finding out some sort of a secrecy about this person and something that has transpired and some information is going to be coming out. I see love is coming for you ladies, 45 years and older, whatever that was happening and transpire in this new year, right up to your birthday. If you were looking for love or love or um, a grandchild is going to be coming in your life. So ladies, um, 45 years and older, um, a grandchild is going to be coming in your life or some of you are going to be having new love and a, a new start in love. And that is good. Then we look at the people who were born on the 14th. I see some of you men took a gamble and you have lost. So um, that's why it's a year of resin, a revel, revelation, self-revelation. Um, because whatever is uh, transpiring, I see that some of you men had worked together with a cancer man and take some sort of a risk. And I see revolution. I see a huge revolution came out and you have lost. So, um, people who are born on the 15th, you have a male enemy. You got to be aware of this. Whoever this person is, you have a male enemy, but whoever this person is, try to take your um, happiness and joy away. And you got to be aware of this. A tower moment is coming in in order to remove and release um, this person from you. There is some sort of a, a situation where someone was um, like um, the person was... Um, um, you know, investigating you. So people who were born 15th of November, you got to be aware of whatever that was transpiring. You got to be on top of your name. I see some of you are going to be balancing out some sort of an issue um, with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. This person could be a family member, whoever this person is. I see you're going to be balancing out some sort of an issue for this person. You realize that some sort of a play and injustice was done against this person and you're trying to help this person to rebalance 
some sort of a deceptive play that has transpired. So it is wonderful. There is no question about this. It is a wonderful um, year that is going to be coming in. It is good to order a birthday reading or you can order a year reading 2021 because um, there is now 15% on these reading. Um, it's good, always good to order a birthday reading because then you are aware of what is coming up in your life. So I want to say thank you for being here. Please like, share these videos. It's going to be a powerful year of a uh, uh, year of secrets are revealed. And whoever that was blocking some of you, it's going to be over. Namaste.